you go to do random testing, random drug testing, and that seemed to be the acceptable way of doing it, we would ask more. We would ask that any time an officer fires his gun or draws his gun, that he be tested immediately. Now, we're not asking the officer to go on the record and make a statement. We know that's a, a contractual problem that you have. But the drug testing for steroids, it's extremely important to find out if the officer was in his right mind when he fired his gun. I think we all would like to know that. If you wait three days or you do random testing, no way to know that. So we're wrong on this. We apologize. But it looks like it's random testing. And random testing, I used to work for the federal government. Some of you know that. We had random drug testing, and we knew when it was coming. So it's really not random. Because we knew that SHOP-03 would be drug tested on May 4th. And on May 4th, we had random drug testing on schedule, 9 o'clock. So random drug testing has its own set of problems. We would suggest that the officer not be forced to make statements. Just do the drug test. Find out if there's any steroids in the person's system, just like if somebody is involved in a crash and he's staggering. You might want to do a drug test on that person that's driving the car. It's the same concept. Thank you. Thanks. Mr. Walsh, my understanding is, and you will appreciate this as a former union organizer, that this is a subject of mandatory bargaining, and that that's why we have the regulations that we have as far as when and where you can test it. But it would have to be subject to the next bargaining. Is that correct? Yeah, I get that. I used to be a chief union steward, so I know about the bargaining. Yes. Okay, so this is indeed random testing. It's right there on item number one, and that's what we're permitted to do under the bargaining agreement, right? Correct. And we're not necessarily permitted to do any more than that at the moment. No, we would have to bargain that. Okay. And I believe we tried to do that. That was on the bargaining table at the last, because I think we share some of the concerns. You can't open up a contract to bargain. 